Okay. We've got ourselves a Hyrule field. Although, I'm actually going to go right back into the forest pretty quick here. Blue, that sounded really creepy. Look, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Blue gets, or Link gets, one, two, three, four, sort of five girlfriends, I think, altogether, depending on how you classify them. He's a, he's a player. <laughs> it's what he does. So, before I leave Kokiri Forest completely, we should go check out the Lost Woods. Uh, there's at least one thing we should do before we leave. But, uh, I, I mean, I like being completionist, so I try to get this done, you know, before we go. It would be more efficient if we came back here after we went to visit the princess, because we'd have, uh, a, another song, but... I don't know. I like to pick this up right away because it's pretty easy. So there's this little target here. I'm so good. I'm friggin' ninja. Cool! You're great! You got three perfects! Here, have a neat present! Take it! So that's your ammo upgrade. Number one. Now let's see if I can remember how to get the other stuff in this forest. This is where I disappoint everyone by not remembering all of the other tricks for the forest. Okay, follow along with our song on your ocarina. We'll lead you to it. Alright, I can do this. Bam! On the drum. I think these are randomly generated to some degree as well, aren't they? Maybe. I'm not 100%. Anyway, we had a nice session. So have... A single rupee. Unfortunately, we have to do it like two more times. I'm pretty sure you get a heart out of this, don't we? Well, they are like lost kids, right? They're Kokiri spirits that stayed in the Lost Woods for too long and are on the way of turning into a Stelfos or something. If I remember the lore. But yeah, the music is terrible. I, I agree. We got two songs played. You notice the song got longer and the reward got bigger. I think this is the last time. It's always threes, right? It's definitely not the best minigame. I, I do sympathize for all you guys with this section. <laughs> Wait, no! <laughs> I don't think you have to do them all in the row though, right? Right? They don't start me back at the beginning. These don't start me back at the beginning. Yeah, they got me. I know. Sorry, chat. The problem is reading chat while also trying to remember the minigame. <laughs> Always my my weakness. Alright, we're getting there. The bell of shame, yeah.
One more. Lots of A's. I like the A's. Uh-oh. This is it. This is the last one. Eight notes. Not bad. I can do that. All right, we got it. And that was quite a nice session. Here, have our hearts, right? Please. There we go, our first piece of hearts. All right, we're making progress now, guys. Well, that wasn't the worst. So, before we go deeper into the forest, there is a couple other places. Thanks, Rides. So if I had a, a certain song, we could get another piece of heart from that guy, but I don't have that ready to go. Now, I know we did this in the pre-stream, but I'm going to show this off for the video tubers as well. Someone can correct me, but I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be able to get your stick upgrade here from 10 to 20. But something about the emulator or something has caused this guy to glitch out. So he's not able to shoot... Like, he actually doesn't fire properly, and even though I can, you know, trigger him, I can't talk to him. So I'm not sure what the deal is here. It's a business scrub. Anyway, maybe you're supposed to do this later on in the game and I'll come back, but I feel like I used to be able to do this before we left the forest, and I'm... I'm pretty sure he's the stick upgrade, but someone might have to fact check me on that. I think he gets you from 10 to 20 sticks. Uh, but it might be something else. Like, I, I don't really remember. Yeah, stick... I, I thought it was a stick upgrade, but... You know. I'm not 100%. Okay, so let's explore the rest of the forest while we're here, if I can remember the route. Uh, so we're at the entrance, then we go right one, then left one. There is kind of a trick, like... So... If this was your first time playing it, um, you sort of crawl up to the edge here and see, like, it just stays dark. And then if you walk through it, you get teleported to the entrance, basically. So if this was your first time playing or if you forgot, that's the gimmick. There's also, you can listen to the music, but that's no fun. Just, just sneak towards the entrance and the, you can see to the next room. So, this one looks interesting, although we're not going to be able to do anything here, but I'll show this off. The Kokiri Forest is essentially our uh, teleporting hub, actually. So, Goron City is somewhere from much later in the game. Or, a fair bit later. Yeah, the gimmick is the, the... The music is the default gimmick, but I like being able to just see into the next room. Because that's, like, easier for me. Oh look, some bugs! If I had a bottle, we could make some money, but... Anyway. So that was, uh, Goron City Shortcut. This will be Zora's Domain Shortcut. But we'll need, uh, an upgrade for that. Also, the Green Fairy generally means that a Scarecrow will pop up. Although I forget for sure. It usually means a Scarecrow can show up there. Or maybe the Mask of Truth can do something. Something that way. Uh, I think it was straight through this one, but I'll check the corners. Oh, this is one of those secret rooms, right? What do you sell, sir? Yeah, I can't talk to any of these guys. That's weird. Some Something's glitched out. I can't actually talk to the business scrubs. And then this guy's not able to shoot either, is he? So this might just be an emulator problem. I'm not really sure. Seems suspicious. Uh, anyway, you go to the butterflies. We'll try this out. 
I believe this is the other stick upgrade, if I remember correctly. If we do this. Uh... By this, I mean come back as an adult? Is that what it is? I forget. Man, it's been so long since I did anything down here. Maybe I need some music. This this might be one of those use your ocarina to unlock the, the mini game. This wow, this is actually a room I barely remember. I'm pretty sure it gives you the stick upgrade, but I actually forget what you have to do. It's probably a music one. We'll be back. I will definitely come back to figure that out. These uh little seed spots are for traveling between time, obviously, with your little uh trigger. The scrubs are on strike, yeah. Sounds about right. Okay, that was where we came from. Okay, so. Thanks, fairy. So if the right would be a dead end, I think it was straight through. Yep. And I think this was it. So this is like the last screen, basically. Unless there's another secret. Nope, I was wrong. This is the second last screen. I don't know, I'm lost. I'm lost in the lost woods. Pretty sure it's right on the screen. I'm just gonna check the other ones first. This should lead me to uh, the end of the forest. Yeah. So, sacred metal. We can't really do anything here anyway. I just wanted to show that I remember how to get here. So, if you were really, you know, if you wanna have some fun, you can go walk your way through the meadow and get basically nothing. <laughs> All right, Benu. <laughs> that <laughs> that's a good. One. Bring on the puns. Pixel will be extremely disappointed he missed off on the pun part. The pun party. Anyway, I just want to have a little bit of fun in Lost Woods. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be able to get your seed upgrade and your stick upgrade. Uh, we don't have Serious Song yet because you have to go to the castle first and then come back to get Serious Song. Uh, you have to talk to Princess and get the letter before you can unlock the song. Oh good! Owl tutorial. It appears that I am going to talk to you for a long time. You will encounter many owls ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the longest conversation. Do you want to repeat- you want me to repeat everything again? All right, I'll repeat everything again. How many times did you get caught by saying no there and having him repeat the whole thing over and over again? I was thinking I could try to shoot him down, but no luck. You know, I should be hurrying here. If I can get across the field quick enough, we can uh, get some rupees on the uh, castle drawbridge. Now, I'm just doing a very minor sort of glitch here. I don't know if you call it a glitch. Probably not even saving myself very much time. But uh, if you walk backwards with the camera locked, uh, you do move a little bit faster. That's how the speedrunners do it. I'm pretty, pretty awesome. Mostly, I just want to get across Hyrule Field to Hyrule Castle before night. And if you walk at normal speed, you pretty much always get locked out in front of the castle. Oh, crap. Well, I was doing real good. I guess we'll just get locked out in front of the castle. I think I went the wrong way. Ah! I had it. I was. I made such good time across that field. I had all this spare time to get across that bridge. <laughs> There's the little ledge. Man, I haven't fallen into this moat in a long time. All right. Naruto, <laughs> my ninja points go down and ma mark again. So instead we get to kill some zombies. Would you like to learn more? The great Deku tree wanted us to blah 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 blah. It's a stall child, don't be afraid, just kill it. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're, we're hanging out with all the Kokiri kids that left the forest. That's about right. We're working on our genocide run, guys. That's what we're really doing. It's gonna take a while to kill everything, so... Gotta start now. Hey, it's Super Zombie! Every now and then you get a giant one. Bad Zombie. There we go. We're doing some style here. Figuring out the combat even better than before. Circle! Slash! Now, honestly, the uh, the combat in this game mostly just makes me want to play Wind Waker again. Wind Waker was the Zelda where they really got the uh, combat fluid, I think. Like, the combat in Ocarina is good, don't get me wrong. But, um, Wind Waker is when they really nailed it. Oh! 60 rupee skeleton! I don't think I've ever seen them drop that much money. That's nuts! Did you guys know about that? 60 rupees from one skeleton. I've played this game a lot, and I don't think I've ever seen that. For those of you watching on the videos, man, are you missing out on some crazy puns in chat. I was thinking I was going to have to climb the drawbridge gate to get all the secret rupees, but nope. No need. We are rich. This is also one of my favorite parts. Mostly because you can break all the pots. There's a fair bit of money in here as well. Not that we need it. But just break everything. Man, I am so bored. Blah, blah, blah. That's why you really come into this room. Am I using a game genie? <laughs> no. Uh, I think the pots up there have maybe red rupees? I think you... How do you get up there easily? There, there is a way. I'm trying to remember. Look at that Helion shield on the wall. High graphics. HD. Oh, I thought that would have made it for sure. Anyway, I used to know all kinds of weird tricks about jumping around these kinds of areas. It doesn't matter. Let's hang out. This is this is as far as I got in my uh, uh, pre-recorded area. Now, for some reason, something about Hyrule Castle Courtyard or Hyrule Town looks a little off to me. I think it's too bright or too colorful. It looks like we're suddenly in, like, Mario 64. So, I'm not sure what happened with this specific area. Hey, your clothes, they're different! Hello, girlfriend number two. You're not from around here, are you? Oh, uh, you're a fairy boy! Haha, <laughs> my name's Malin. My dad owns the ranch. Dad went to the castle to deliver some milk, and he hasn't come back yet. Time for a milk run. I made a lot of money. Maybe I should go look for more things to sell. I know, I should go to Lake Hylia. Many things float down the river and end up there. Haha. <laughs> we'll talk to some people, why not? I can't catch that cuckoo. You mean this cuckoo? No, that's this cuckoo's cuckoo lady. Back here. Back here, cuckoo! I'm gonna show that little girl that I can catch you. I'm not dancing, you know. My back itches. Come here, chicken. Ah, my face. It's a terrible chicken. Now you can't. You oh, you can use your sword. Ha! Ah, chicken. Get dinner. This child needs food. This child is hungry. I must help. This is all Ocarina of Time really is. Just two kids chasing a chicken around the castle yard. Stupid chicken. 
All right. Um, yeah, we're never gonna be able to deal. <laughs> when did we get to Castle Town? We've been here a while. Huff huff. I'm late. I'm late for a very important date. It's the rabbit. Are we actually reading a book? Wow! What a crazy guy! Can you believe this guy was crazy enough to try to sneak into the castle to see Princess Zelda? All because of this idiot, they've tightened security at the castle. <laughs> He's hilarious. Ahem, er, this beard is my pride and joy. Doesn't it look luxuriant, kid? What? You're looking for the guy from Lon Lon Ranch. Uh, maybe... I saw a guy with a shabby-looking beard delivering some boxes to the castle. Kid, have you been to Lon Lon Ranch? Their milk is delicious! There are many horses there, and the young daughter of the ranch owner is cute! To get to Lon Lon Ranch, walk out of the castle! My precious puppy can run faster than any of the other mutts around here! All right, let's go play some game. All right, time to lose all of our money. I'm actually gonna put a save state down because my ah, my sensitivity is so bad. Do you want to play a game, kid? Thanks for the money and the leg. All right, uh, all right, one, two. Three. I remember how to play this game. Nope. No. No. No bucks. You know what? If I only miss one, I'm pretty happy. Oh, I missed two, but still not bad. All right, I'm feeling a bit happier. It's just timing mostly, right? Oh, ah. so sensitive. All right, line it up in the middle. And we got this, guys. No! <laughs> I don't remember the timing for those ones. All right, we're close, though. Oh, man, the sensitivity is too much. All right, we're off to a good start. We can do this. All right. No! <laughs> Nine! Ah. Uh. Where's all my ninja points when I need them? This definitely feels more... Like, I feel like my hook sh my slingshot moves way quicker than I'm used to. God, first one. Sheesh, I keep missing the same one, even. What took that rupee so long? Sheesh. Oh. <laughs> well, let's see if I can get the timing on the right scrollers. Oh, man. Failing. Oh, my worst one yet. Yeah, the sensitivity is really rough. I think it's actually sort of a problem of the GameCube version. It's just more sensitive than uh, the original N64. So you've got to be really good. I, mostly, I just don't remember the timing for the, uh, the other direction. If I fail one more time, I'll do uh, a trick. I'll do a little cheat. Just to make it a little bit easier. Oh, I'll fail again. But I, I have to get the timing on the, uh, the second set of reds. And I just keep... It's like right before the rupee crosses the, the left side of the, uh, the slingshot or something. 
So we're gonna cheat. Let me put a save state down so I don't have to spend all my money again. But I can do this. I you just gotta believe. Counts. Alright, we can do this. Dang it! So close, come on. Alright, well. Oh, you know what? I could have had a free play there because I had most of them. You just have to get eight to get a free play, right? So. Dang it, I couldn't move it just a tiny little bit to the left I needed. Hope you like this music. Okay, I think I've got the timing for the, the scrollers. Try holding down the shoot button. Maybe. I just need to get the timing down, I feel like. The the accuracy is, is half the battle. But I just need to remember when to shoot... Um, for the scrolling rupees, it's very important you have the timing down. This time for sure. Oh! <laughs> so close. Minigame music for days with me, Blue Ankylo. Oh, the jumpy. That one tricks you. If you're not lined up really quick for that one, you can miss it. Oh, no. Alright, I finally got both of the, the red scrollers. Ah. Oh, I could have had it free. Whatever. Here we go. No excuses, just shoot well. Aha! It only took 10 to 20 tries. All right, we maxed out our bullet bag. Totally useless upgrade, but. We have mastered the slingshot. Thank you, chat. Thank you for the, thank you for the help. I did spend all my money after all, but it's okay. Ha! Ah, okay, let's go to the secret side of Castletown where no one ever really goes because it's boring. The back alley. Hey, what? what's wrong with that loitering around all day, huh, kid? This is kind of the area where there's nothing to do. There's some weird door. Can't I? Oh, this doesn't quite line up with the map either, interestingly. It seems strange that packs of dogs roam the streets at night. Doesn't that seem weird to you? So what did I get for mastering the slingshot? A larger bag of bullets. We can hold 50 bullets instead of, uh, instead of 40. Hey, Sunny, blah, 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 blah. There's a fountain of magic near the, near the castle. So that's the bomb chew shop, but it'll be closed for now. Um, this was the mystery... This is probably close, too. Treasure chest contest, yeah. Can we trade puns for angular points? Oh, I don't know. That's dangerous. Just gonna explore all the rooms now. This is the Hyrule Bazaar. The only thing that might be useful here is the Helian Shield. I heard a rumor there's a monster that eats Helian Shields. Oh, no. And also some ammo refills. Um, potion shops, so you could, uh, buy some stuff for a bottle. If we had a bottle, we could put a fish or a ghost in it. Sure, a random potion salesman has a ghost on the sh shelf. Why not? Makes perfect sense to me. I'll take one ghost to go.
let's go check out the Temple of Time while we're here, just to be thorough. Aw, oh, the, the, uh, the clouds around Death Mountain aren't quite lined up. What a shame. There are three hollows and an inscription here. Ye who own three spiritual stones, stand with the Ocarina of Time and play the Song of Time. So, uh, you know, it might be important. Maybe there's also a way to just cheese it and skip it and go straight to straight through that wall, but we're not going to do anything like that. All right, so that's the Temple of Time. Just just so you guys know, it's probably important for later. We could talk to some, uh, some Sheik Stones, I believe they're called. This statue's one-eyed gaze pierces into your mind. Once we have uh, a cool magic magnifying glass, we can probably talk to them. Or no, not not the glass, the mask. 